Hey, I'm Maria back with another video. It's like 4.08 p.m. November 8th. It's Thursday. So I'm waiting for my laundry to get done. I just did some laundry for my um, my bed linens. <laughs> and I am uh, just had to replace my, what do you call it, my heated mattress pad because um, the one that I had last year, in a few years I had, um, you know, finally took a, took a dump on me. So had to replace it and it's been getting very chilly in the middle of the night you know anyway so i'm doing that and i'm getting ready to remake my bed and um wind down for the evening but i was thinking about um so much hoopla about the whole face suck issue and all this other garbage um i have noticed i know i was watching um one of ray joe's videos which i think she has great videos she's i, I really enjoy watching her videos um I can just sit there and watch them all day. She's a very well-read person, and I respect her a lot. Anyway, um, but she was talking about how when you get targeted, um, oftentimes, like, for example, if there's rumors, there's gossip, there's um, people talking and making up drama stories around a, a particular person, then all of a sudden, you'll start noticing people coming into your life and then noticing that, like, for example, if you're a woman, then suddenly you're like this beautiful woman all of a sudden, you know. And, um, you know, I notice that you know, I get a lot of people friending me on Facebook. And, you know, I, I, I don't think that, you know, I'm gorgeous, you know, I don't think that. But I know that when you're targeted, it's like these people are kind of playing up on this whole, um, what do you call it? They play up on the um the whole targeting issue so you get a lot of guys contacting you through facebook and stuff like that and i never respond to them um i have talked to one of course he was so young he was like old young enough to be my son um uh, but he was a very sweet little boy uh, guy i should say and we just kind of talked about various things but it's, it's this sort of stuff so people create this drama around a person you know that really if the drama was not originally created it wouldn't happen. It wouldn't happen unless somebody is deliberately doing that. And then it creates this whole spiral of other people coming in and doing it. So it's a lot of, what do you call it, mind manipulation, herd mentality, running amok. Um, that goes the same for, for guys. Like, for example, if somebody says something about a guy and then there's some sort of story about it, then all of a sudden people are going to be targeting this person. Not that they're particularly interested in this person, it's just a part of the fun and the games. And it's like, it's bullshit, you know? Um, I'm just a person who tries to get on with their life. I'm not interested in, you know, uh, meeting people through Facebook or, or anything crazy like that, you know? I get tired of and resent um, all the, uh, what do you call it, the bullshit. I just do, you know? And I certainly... Um, feel as though this thing has been blown way out of proportion and I'm, I'm not comfortable with it. I'm not comfortable with that at all. I'm somebody who just like, enjoys like, you know, the basic things in life. Um, I don't wear extravagant clothing, meaning I don't spend a lot of my clothes. I don't, I don't, you know, whereas some women do. And it seems as though some other, some other women that I personally feel should be getting targeted, whereas I'm not really, shouldn't be getting the target. Now, maybe people might be interested in my psychic skills. Maybe I can understand that part of it. But, you know, um, I'm not somebody who's putting myself out there to, you know, jump into the dating scene, okay? I did mention the cute guy, of course, but I'm not interested in dating people at work or anything like that. And so I get very upset when people even imply that. I, I do. I get very upset about it. Obviously, I'm a woman who has to take care of themselves. And this is the, the issue with so many targeted women because people want to involve them in their stupid dramas, you know. And uh, I, I don't want to be involved in any drama. You know, I'm the kind of person, I just, my ideal life is just going to work, coming home, Ideally, you know, if I had a better family unit, which I do get to spend time with my son every once in a while, but, you know, I would spend time with my family if I had, you know, a family. Um, then if I had more, you know, friends or something, I'd spend time with them, but I'm a very go-to-work, come-home type person, just mind my own business, and that's how I choose to live my life. I can't see myself living a life any other way. Um, so I, I get tired when, like, you know, Karen's sitting here thinking, 
you know, I, I have to I isolate this person and I have to throw her and make her work way, way, way from other people. I'm not interested in intermingling with men. I just miss, I miss working in an environment where I'm with other people in general, preferably women. I mean, I do like talking to women, although I know women can be catty, okay? But oftentimes when women are catty, there's somebody making them catty, and that could very well be Karen, you know? Um, I'm tired of the whole thing. I really am. And um, I just wish that, <laughs> I just wish people would leave me alone. That's all. I just want to be left alone. I mean, I just want, you know, to work a regular job like everyone else and come home, do my work, and do, you know, live my, live my life, you know? And I, I don't... I get sick of the whole Facebook drama and Karen making up stories and and the whole thing. I get tired of it, you know. Um, it's just it's a it's a fine form of mind control, you know. I, I I saw a woman walking down the street. It was over the F, close to F Street, right? And I know I was coming home right around one o'clock, twelve thirty, one o'clock. Now, this woman had a very nice outfit on. I would say, you know, she's a, a, a decent-looking woman. I kept thinking, I wonder if she targeted. I wonder if she targeted. I wonder if some. But see, they're not. Why are, are, is she not targeted? Why is she not targeted? And I am. And the reason why is because somebody is creating drama around me. That's why. Okay. And I get tired of that drama. I get so tired of it because I, 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 I'm, not, I'm not somebody who wants to, to be that way. I, I don't want that kind of attention. And the reason why I'm getting that kind of attention is because, like I said, you know, there's the, the talk, the gossip, and everything else. And I, you would think that everybody would know that Maria doesn't do anything. Maria it does the same thing over and over and over again. Every once in a while, I'll break my jujitsu team. And head over to head over to like a dollar store or something like that after work, and then I come home. So it's it's pretty much the same thing over and over and over again, you know. And I get, I just wish to God people would just get off of it already, you know. I I really do. I do, you know. And I I get upset because you know it's like how how is it that somebody could ignore. Um, or just kind of disregard somebody's human, human, a human life like that. How is it that somebody could make a mockery out of somebody trying to live their life? You know, I understand that, you know, some people might look at it as unconventional because I'm not married or whatever. Well, obviously, I just recently got divorced, okay? And some people, maybe they think I should be out there looking for somebody or whatever. Well, you know, not everybody wants to just jump in to something like that. Like I said, you know, the cute guy is welcome here anytime, you know. <laughs> but I'm saying is like I, I, I just, you know, people have their preferences. They have their ideas of who and what they want in a person. And, you know, I, I'm, I just, it's just not, that's not a priority of mine, okay. I don't, it's not a priority of mine. It just isn't, you know. And um, I know a lot of times when people... Um, interact with the opposite sex it's not something that I feel is um, a respectable thing a lot of men can be very disgusting at times you know what I mean so I'm I just I don't really and there's obviously women who are meant to cater to that kind of man you know that's what the strip clubs are for <laughs> basically but anyway, I'm going to wrap up this video I'm going to get my laundry done make up my bed, I got to run out and get some water same old stuff and then uh, follow up on some text messages so i will be back with another video later have a wonderful evening